boy. Yes, you are. Yes, you are. Yes, you Candy, I wasn't finished. Yeah, well, well, I have rights here, and, and, and I intend to pursue those rights with all the means at my disposal. Yeah. Well, okay, okay, goodbye. Listen, why don't we share custody of Chester, you know? You get one week and I get one week. It doesn't make any difference. Dog weeks and people weeks are the same thing. <laughs> Because your mother gives you an allowance. Look, I'm just trying to be fair here. Speaking of fair, it doesn't seem fair that Mom has to pay me and you don't. Hang on, Candy. Let me explain something to you. Every cent your mother has comes from me. So when she gives you allowance, it's really me giving you allowance. I don't mean to know how it works. I just need more money. Take a number. Sorry, go ahead. Six. Morning. Morning. Look, if Chester is going to live anywhere full time, I, I don't see why it shouldn't be here. I do. I see why. <laughs> when he split with your mother, did they fight like this over your custody? They still do. You take him. No, you take him. Okay. 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 Fine. You, you want this to get ugly? You, you want to play hardball? I will. I will play hardball. <sighs> want something to drink? Oh, yeah. my little hard body. He took off with that girl you brought home. <laughs> Other than that, your plan worked like a charm. Fine. Go ahead and mock me. I could have died out there. Well, the sea is a harsh mistress. And you're a moron. <laughs> what? You said to mock you? It's no joke, Ellen. Come on. You, you tried to scam your way into a surf bunny shorts and ended up French kissing a handsome young lifeguard. <laughs> How is that not a joke? <laughs> it's not a joke because something happened out there while I was drowning. What? Did your entire sordid, degenerate life flash before your eyes? I wish. <laughs> no, no, no. It was... No, you're not going to believe me. Try me. I saw Dad. Oh, baloney. <laughs> you know what? Just forget it. Oh, come on. It was probably just a hallucination caused by, you know, brain cells dying. <laughs> no, I'm used to that. <laughs> this was no hallucination. Dad was right there in the water with me. All right, all right, for the sake of argument, let's assume that you saw the spirit of our dead father. Well, what did he do? Reach a hand out to guide you to the great beyond? Don't be ridiculous. He didn't have hands. <laughs> it was just his head kind of floating there like the great and powerful Oz. <laughs> or one of the pep boys. <laughs> Manny, Mo, or Jack? What's going on? She's helping Yertle the turtle study for his test. Why didn't they ask me? Name three contributions the Roman Empire made to civilization. Uh, orgies, wine, and bulimia. Go ahead, ask me about the Greeks. Then who did invent aromatherapy? Not the Romans. But well, you see my logic. You know, I never did understand why you didn't give her more of a chance. She's pretty, smart, and amazingly patient with dumb guys. Are you talking about Jake or me? A smart guy wouldn't have to ask that question. Excuse me, but let's not forget, this is a woman who stalked me, who spied on me, who snuck into my house to write her name and address in my underwear. Oh, boo-hoo, somebody cares about Charlie. Nobody ever wrote their name in my underwear. Wait, once, the Department of Corrections. Morning. Morning. Hey. Oh, hey, guys. How's the homework coming? 
the three major buildings in ancient Rome were the Colosseum, the Forum, and... Circus. Circus Circus. We need a little more time. Carry on. I know it's not Caesar's Palace. Charmin reinvented the square for a smoother tear. Are you kidding? She has advanced degrees in, like, three subjects. She loves him, he worships her, and the only thing she asks in return is to sit naked in your laundry hamper every once in a while. And that's not a red flag for you? You could do a lot worse than Rose, Joe. I have done a lot worse. But that's not really a recommendation now, is it? Hey, Berta, you want to hear something cool? The ancient Romans had a place called a vomitorium where people could eat as much as they wanted, puke, and then eat some more. <laughs> no, just like the sizzler. <laughs> Hey, morning, buddy. You suck. Whoa. Has the little prince not taken his morning poop yet? 